Hi everybody, um, here we are for my July favorite. Um, there's not going to be a empty video this month because of lots of things. Um, so it's just going to be a bigger one for next month, I guess. Um, I just wanted to show you some of the products I really liked using uh, this month and of course a little bit of other things uh, that I really enjoyed so maybe you can like it too if you know about it sorry I look a little bit uh, tired of everything uh, it's really hot and humid here so it's a little bit hard to sleep and actually I had to stop my fan to film this video so it's even worse now so I'm gonna try to make it a little bit quick so that I stop suffering and still you can have a little bit of what could be good to try about Korea because uh, for most of the products I'm gonna show you here well all of the cosmetics I'm gonna show you are from Korean brand um, some other things are just not Korean but anyway let's start so I tried it was just a coincidence um, I needed some makeup because I had to go to teach a class and I felt that I looked like a ghost so I tried because you know everybody heard about you know the cushion these uh, little um, BB cream like you press with this and then you put it on so actually I used the Misha I'm gonna show it to you I used the Misha perfect cover BB cream number 21 for a couple of years now I really really like it so I didn't try that much other BB cream because most of the time, because I like this one so much, I dislike all of the other ones. But, you know, now the cushion, it's really, really practical. I mean, you have your BB cream and you have the mirror and everything. And you can see lots of Korean women like, you know, oh, I'm in the bus. I'm checking my makeup and everything. So I tried the Misha Signature Essence Cushion in number 21 of course because <laughs> nice enough the 21 from this one and the 21 from this one is the exact same color and actually I'm wearing it now with a little bit powder because this one makes uh, your skin a little bit more glowy because it's more of a trend here like it's not a matte formula a little bit of glowing but it's a little bit too glowy for me so I put a little bit of powder over it um, basically I would say you need to try that once even if it's not a Misha uh, BB cream try a cushion once it's really easy to apply of course at first you're like um, how do I do that but I mean it's a really really good thing to try well, at least once and because for that same school I went the second time I forgot to put a little bit of makeup and it was like a more colorful uh, day so I ended up uh, going to Nature Republic and actually there was a sale so <laughs> for everything it cost me just like nothing and I tried the Nature Republic Provence Tree Magic Step Highs so basically you have like three colors with a little sponge applicator uh, i got it was two for well one plus one so you got two of them for the same price and i got the pink one and the um, more neutral one you have a little um really beige natural color a more browns and a more little copper and both of these work perfectly you don't even need to put a primer before to get the colors um, I was really surprised without a primer it didn't crease at all and believe me here it's always hot and humid in July 
so I was really happy about that and on the same time I decided to buy a mascara it's the wild mascara curling actually I was shocked because I kind of used it and I could see my lashes do that uh, it's that efficient and I was also surprised to see like the wand which is very very small uh, you know what is it gonna do but actually it's pretty much the best thing ever so I know that it's not available everywhere like it might be a little bit of problems to get it but if you can get the Nature Republic Wild Mascara Curling uh, go for it if you can get this one I mean I think there's no way that you wouldn't like it unless you have like the already very curly and everything you wouldn't need it so that's it for makeup now I have a couple of products I uh, like people that knows me they know that I really like Innisfree so I decided to try the green barley gommage peeling because I needed uh, you know my face is really sensitive skin so I need something that is not gonna be harsh you know the big grain that people use like to scrub really uh, no it's not for me like my skin's getting red and hurts and so okay so I decided to try this one and actually it was kind of surprising at first it's like a little bit of ugh but then it really it's really interesting so you know it's a little bit oh I put way too much so like you can see it's really liquid so you just put it and you wait till it dries so it's probably gonna be impossible since it's so humid here but anyway um, when it's dry then you try to just rub it and <laughs> it feels like your skin's going out with it like it does I'm gonna try to show it at the end of the video to to see how it, it works so this one um, actually it smells not that much but it smells good well you need to let it dry so you put it with your uh, dry skin you put it on you wait till it's dry and then you rub it with a little bit of water you just they say to just um, put a little bit of water on your fingertips and then you rub and I was kind of very impressed the way it's it's appealing but your face don't it doesn't look like your skin is shrinking or anything so actually it really is and it's not that expensive actually so I would recommend to go and buy this one if you can or ask for your friend in Korea to send it to you because it's always a good way to get the products and then in July I tried a new brand there was a new store that opened in Gangnam so I went there and I'm talking about Vanilla Co. so I have two products from them uh, this one is the Clean It Zero Purity for sensitive skin but you have like the same one for um, regular skin that is a little bit less expensive and you have more in the pot so the, um, the girl gave me a little sample to try saying you know try it and if you don't have a, re a reaction to it like buy the other one because it's cheaper and you have more so um, I didn't try the regular one but the one for sensitive skin is really perfect I really like it so basically you have like that little um, spoon and the product is um, it looks a little bit like candle wax so you really need the little spatula to take it off so uh, you take it and you need to rub your fingers a little bit and it's transformed into kind of an oil so you can wash your face uh, it removes makeup and everything so it's really um, it's a cleanser 
it's a makeup remover and then your skin is not dry like it's uh, hydrating in a way because it's an oil and I was really I was really happy to try this one because it's a little bit on the expensive side for this one but since you need so little to do your face I mean it's a good uh, I think it's a good deal and actually you have a card because there is a little sticker inside the, the, the pot uh, and when you buy four you get one free so in a way it gets a little less expensive and you think if you think about it so um, I'm gonna try probably later the regular formula but this one this one was pretty amazing as it is so I would recommend it and then my last skincare products I know it's just a sample but actually I got um, enough samples um, for <laughs> I'm gonna show you I put all the samples in a pot like this one which is 30 milliliters and I put some of the samples uh, inside this pot because I was getting low on the pot so I got enough to really really try it I'm not done yet but it's probably the best uh, it's supposed to be a cream because it's called Bird Nest Forever Young Multi Care Lifting Cream. But actually, it, the texture is more like a gel. Um, and since here it's so hot and humid, you don't want to put a cream because it, it feels like it doesn't get into the skin. It stays there and be oily and uh, uncomfortable. But this one being a gel texture, it's really really nice uh, I really really like it I feel that my skin is uh, really hydrated and not sticky or anything like the product really penetrate the skin and leave it uh, just just really nice uh, I try to use it like twice a day but me being me I ended up using it more like <laughs> in the night time just before going to bed and I know bird nest means that it's bird's pit, basically. Uh, but I mean, you don't feel like you put bird's pit on your skin. It's really a nice thing. And yeah, it's a bit expensive, but probably I would consider buying it. Uh, later when I'm gonna be done and it's not gonna be tomorrow because if you look at this like the pot is almost uh, It's almost full so I have it for quite some time and probably um, I'm gonna have to check like you know a little bit more during uh, fall or winter Maybe it's not gonna be enough because my skin tend to be dry as a desert So we'll see later so that's basically it for the products. Um, I have two books to recommend this month. Actually, this one is in French. Um, some of my subscribers already know about that book. Did you read it? What? Did you? You should. Um, it's called Jackie Salaberry, uh, Collectionneur de Virus. And it's a very, very nice story from my friend um, Mel, who is the author of this book. I recommend it 300%. You need to, uh, to read that story. It's a steampunk um, world. Uh, like The intrigue is really nice. The, the characters are really well done. I'm really, really proud to, um, to be one of the readers of that genius author Mel you are the one you should never forget that so uh, basically I know it's French I know some people have problems with French um, reading French but you should try you should really try you would you would probably like it no not probably you will like it so try that okay and the second book was a recommendation. I know that book for quite some time, but I never really thought about putting it in a video. 
and it's uh, the diary of Dana in Korea so basically this book is all in Korea but you know it's a BD so you um, follow Dana who is in um, a white girl that is studying in Korea so uh, you see like going to the hospital going shopping having a date uh, going doing sports and like buying a new computer and things like that and what is nice it's that some of the vo vocabulary that could be a little bit more difficult are translated in English at the bottom of the page and sometimes they explain things and actually you have like oh, for this one oh what the attractive place uh, in north and south of Seoul so they explain to you where you can go or with like let's say the cosmetics things they explain to you what kind of skin type you are and how to say it in Korean so if you want to learn Korean in a way that is more interesting uh, I would recommend buying this book it's available easily um, online um, I know that um, some of my friends bought it on Tu Choi. Um, like sometimes the shipping is killing us a little bit, but it's not that expensive actually. In Korea, it's 15,001, so you have to say maybe uh, around 20, 25 dollars um, if you buy it from uh, Canada or United States. But uh, yes, try this one. It's really interesting just to learn Korean. If you're interested in learning Korean, of course. Um, for music, I'm gonna go back with Junsu again. I've been listening to Flower, um, the Flower album again all month. I just can't get enough, I think. It's really, really nice. And if there was um, an album for the Death Note musical, which is not gonna happen, of course, <laughs> uh, I would buy it without hesitation not just for Junsu for everybody in the cast but yeah if you didn't listen to flower not just like the song quote but just the album i really liked it there are so many different types of music on that album so i guess you're gonna find something you like that's for sure and i have a little new cd to put in um that actually couldn't put before because it wasn't released yet so of course I'm talking about just right the um, the new the third uh, mini album of God 7 you need that album in your life um, you you need to go and see the um, music video like just to see like the world they created for that like um, being in a bowl of Fruit Loops or resting on a clock or anything. You see the colorful album, like everything is colorful like that. So if you didn't listen to that, go find it. It's really easy. Just Right is the title song. It's a really good song. So I recommend it 200%. Uh, go for it. It's really nice. And of course, I'm gonna have to say a little a little thing for five seconds of summer again well it's summer why not <laughs> they are really good and I really recommend to try to listen to them of course it's pop music but it's nice pop music so you're gonna like it actually um, for the, I think it's dry enough so I'm gonna try to rub it to show it to you so you see like <laughs> the way you can take it off it's a little bit disgusting at first because it's like uh, what is this is it dirt or anything it's the products it's dead skin cells and everything but the way you rub it it makes it really smooth for the skin so <laughs> it's really nice <laughs> so I would say if you can try it do it you're not like it's just an experience to try it on your face and looking <laughs> like with all of these spots and everything it's nice so just try it you're gonna see if you try one of these products if you like something about you have commentaries about what I talked to you today 
don't be afraid put some com comments uh, below I'm answering all comments all the time so don't be shy um, just go for it and I'm gonna be really happy to answer any question you might have so let's see you next month for favorite um, and probably an empty video and uh, I'm telling you there's gonna be a giveaway it's gonna be next month because uh, this month was a little bit too much for me I had lots of things to do and so I decided to go for it for next month so stay tuned and if you're not subscribed see you